The largest part of the Autodesk Revit user interface is of course the drawing area. You'll also see this often referred to as the canvas. This is where we create and modify the Revit model. When you have a mouse with a scroll wheel on it, which is highly recommended, you can spin the wheel in one direction to zoom in and the other direction zooms out. When you're zoomed in, you can also press down on the wheel button and pan. So you have the ability to pan and zoom very quickly with the wheel and wheel button on your mouse. If you double click on that wheel button, it does a zoom extents. So this minimizes the need to come over here and select the zoom commands on this toolbar. If we select something within the drawing area and hover over it, we can see a tooltip showing what that element is that's selected. If we right click, we see various commands such as the ability to hide this element within the view or to create a similar element. And then oftentimes there are commands very specific to the type of element that you've selected. In this case, we can change the walls orientation. We wouldn't see this command if we had selected text, for example. One more thing to mention within the drawing window is how we can select things. So if we just drag our cursor, so meaning we click the left button and hold the button down and drag from left to right. It doesn't matter if we're going from upper left to lower right or lower left to upper right. When we do this, we'll select everything that's completely within the window and nothing else. You'll notice there's some walls that cross through this window and therefore that wall is not completely within the window and won't and will not be selected. So I can hit escape to unselect anything that's selected. So the escape key on the keyboard. If I do the same selection from right to left, this is called a crossing window as opposed to a selection window. So anything that's completely within or crosses through the window will get selected. I'll hit escape to unselect that as well.